Oh. Yo, we got the bro here. Yeah. How are we doing? Good, how are you? Yeah, good, you? No suitcase in the back, right? No suitcase. Yeah. Yeah. Thank you so much. Merci beaucoup. Merci. Bonjour, bro. Bonjour. What's good? Como ça va? Uh, ça va très bien, bro. I'm with you. Nice. Yeah, yeah, what's good? I'm pretty très bien, too. Oh, nice, bro. That's what's good. <laughs> so we got the bro here. <laughs> man, oh man, it was, yeah, it was wild to get here. Yeah. Took uh, took a couple days of travel plus wow. uh, lost baggage. Wow. But uh, the human body has arrived, so nice. we're here. Hello. Nice. So uh, ça va bien, bro? Oh yeah. Nice, nice. All right, guys, we're here. Got me and my bro Cody. We're waiting for our oldest sister Becky to come out. It's gonna be her first time traveling across the Atlantic Ocean, so it's a pretty big deal. Cody and I have been over to Europe many, many times now. Cody actually lives in Europe in Lisbon, and so. Uh, yeah, she'll be coming out any minute, and we'll give her a nice welcoming to Paris. Well, we gotta keep things uh, exciting here. We were waiting at 2C, and our sister comes out in 2A. So we're gonna hustle down there, and hopefully we beat her outside of the gate. We shall see. Our sister was supposed to arrive at 8.30 a.m., and she said she was gonna text us, but for some reason she couldn't when she was departing out of Chicago. And so we're gonna play a joke on her that we have actually been waiting since uh, one hour before that. She, arrived at, she was supposed to arrive at 8.30 or 9.30? 9.30. So since we, we were waiting since 8.30, one hour before, to make sure we didn't miss her. So she's the nicest person in the world, so she's gonna feel so bad. So hopefully we beat her out here. Yeah, it is a pretty spread out terminal. 2A, there's 2A, B, C, and D. So we are almost down there. But walking at uh, me and my brother's pace, it's very quick. And it still takes us maybe five minutes to get over there. All right, here we go. Arrivals 2A. Let's see, any sign of her over here? All right, we're waiting for any minute now. <laughs> Becky! Bienvenue à Paris! How are you? You made it! Bonjour! Let me get this for you. How was the flight? Oh my gosh. Once I got on it, it was great. Yeah, yeah. Uh, just like five or six hours. <laughs> yeah, no problem. We we're, we're, uh, we wanted to make sure we we're here just in time for you. We don't want to miss the moment. So guys, I want to take a quick pause from the video here as we explore Paris and share with you today's sponsor. I am very excited to share with you guys today BetterHelp in honor of May, which is Mental Health Awareness Month. So guys, there's no doubt that all of us, no matter who we are, whatever walks of life we come from, we deal with various things throughout our life, whether it's relationships, families, um, financial troubles, whatever it could be, things happen throughout your life and I can tell you from my own personal experience, when you have people that you can trust, people that you can talk to and get some real honest, great advice and that is where therapy can be a huge part to help you get through these hard moments. So of course it being Mental Health Awareness Month, I wanted to share this video with you and share with you that it is okay to get help. You know, a lot of people have this concern that if you go out and seek help that people are going to think there's something wrong with you but it is very normal to need help with some of these hardships. I wanna share with you specifically with BetterHelp. They provide therapy that can be customized to whatever you're going through. And the big thing with BetterHelp is you don't have to do it face to face. You can do it through messaging online, you can do it through video messages, you can do it just through a phone call, and it also brings the cost down for you. Of course, BetterHelp being more affordable for people than you know your traditional therapy. I do wanna mention that even if BetterHelp, you think you cannot afford it based on the cost, there are also options to even get financial aid. There is a broad range of expertise throughout BetterHelp. They have over 20,000 therapists that are able to help you and fit your needs. And you'll be able to find the right person after you fill out a short questionnaire. And within about 48 hours, you're going to be connected with someone that can help change your life for the better. So after the questionnaire, you get to schedule and secure video and phone sessions and you can exchange unlimited messages and know that everything you share is completely confidential. Also, if you run into an issue where you aren't happy with the therapist that you're working with, you can always use a different therapist from the massive network they have. This Mental Health Month, if you or someone you know is struggling, give them the recommendation of speaking with a therapist on BetterHelp and that is BetterHelp, H-E-L-P. And you can even use my link to get 10% off your first month with this link right here. You were here the whole time? Yeah, yeah. Why? Oh, because we, uh, we thought you were gonna text us maybe if you were late, so we figured we'd still come at 7, 8.30. You didn't check the log or anything? Uh. Oh, 
<laughs> we were rushing at 8 30 we're like oh what if we're playing we're like, oh we're like becky's probably gonna be like wondering like no, no service what if yeah she's there like <laughs> yeah you know, i don't know where to go and my brother's not there to pick me up yeah yeah we thought you were probably pretty worried what <laughs> yeah. Wait, are you, but then joking? we saw the thing that said you were late so we're like okay cool we're just fine you know we'll, did we'll, it say like how long or anything uh well it did once we were finally here then it did say it was delayed so but it's an hour and 15 minutes away so we were like oh we'll just wait the whole time you guys, you should have like gone and done stuff. I didn't want to miss the moment. Yeah, exactly. Oh my gosh, the I'm moment so was too apart. important. Yeah, yeah. Very I nice. I can't believe you guys were here the whole time. Though. <laughs> yeah. I feel terrible. <laughs> yeah. Are you going to tell her the details, bro? The details? Mm hmm. Yeah. Uh, tell her. April Fools. <laughs> oh my god. I was so glad. I was like, this seems so unlike you guys to not track it, but oh gosh, I've never Actually, yeah. ever. I didn't think to check because you your last message was, uh, let yeah, you know. I'll let you know. Yeah, yeah. So then Cody checked and he was like, oh, our flight's delayed because I would have just gone. Yeah. yeah. I feel so bad. I was like, they'll check, it'll be fine. I told them, but I don't know what's going on. Yeah. Oh my gosh, you guys, I, was, I felt so terrible. Yeah, no, it's really, yeah. Oh. Yeah. Have you been practicing your French? Ça va? Yeah, I do. Très bien. <laughs> Très bien. Yeah. Allons-y. Yeah, yeah. Oh, I've got some. Thank you. Right, cool. yeah. Perfect. So where to next? Uh, uh, head to yeah. the city? Uh, yeah, we'll, uh, we'll grab a taxi. Is Perfect. Like? Yeah, I'm good with whatever. Whatever Becky wants to do. Yeah. First time in Paris. Soccer court. <laughs> All right, soccer core, here we come. So Becky has fallen for the April Fool's joke. <laughs> it's I, was, so hard. <laughs> I was filming the whole time. Were you no yeah. way? Oh my gosh. Yeah, I had to. Oh, yep. That was amazing. I was gonna, yeah. I yeah. yeah, we'll have to show that one to Scotty Boy. Oh my gosh. Yeah, yeah. yeah exactly. <laughs> so, guys, we're going to get get the uh, taxi and take Becky into Paris for her first time ever. Yes. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, let's do it. All right, let's get this thing loaded up. We have made it. Ah, Becky's wow. first cab in Europe. Uh, <laughs> yeah, <laughs> sweet. Let's miss that one. We're making our first stop here with the siblings together. The first time the siblings are in Europe here. <laughs> Crazy, isn't it? Yeah. How are you feeling, bro? Oh, I'm feeling great. Yeah, Becky. Fantastic. Yeah, exactly. So excited. And one hour of sleep too. Yes. Ah, even better. <laughs> yeah. Crazy. yeah. <laughs> so that's amazing. But yeah, guys, super excited. Our first stop, we're actually going to be dropping Becky's bags off at a bounce location. And if you're not familiar with bounce, my brother actually founded a company just over. Oh, got some excitement going on in the streets. Just over three years ago, and it's basically a short-term luggage storage platform. So you arrive to the city, you want to get straight into it, guys. We only have 24 hours till my brother and sister are going to be flying over to Portugal. So in those 24 hours, we've got to make the most of it. If we went all the way to our hotel from the airport, that's an hour and 20 minutes, then another 30 minutes back to the places we're going to go to. But instead, we can go open up the Bounce app, find the closest location, temporarily store the stuff for what is it like six seven euros per bag per uh, day five euros per bag five euros even cheap, even less expensive yeah. than i thought yeah and so drop the bags off there we're gonna go tour the city take you guys with us and then we'll get the bags after and it'll save us so much time so we'll show you a quick little run through of how it works once we get there as becky likes to say time is money <laughs> yeah, yeah. <No> exactly <laughs> All right, so we're stopping at the bounce location and oh, allow me to get this, Becky. You're gonna get your first experience of bounce, Becky. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. incredible, I'm so excited. Yeah. I've heard so much about it. Mm -hmm. Never actually got to experience yeah, it. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. Oh, that's fantastic. Yeah. Area. I know, isn't this such a like picturesque, like it's, it's like exactly what you imagine party to look like exactly. you know like big smaller cobblestone rock. yeah yeah for some reason buildings at an angle make me think <laughs> yeah yeah exactly thank you oh. uh, bonjour you take a bag or you leave in the bag leave yeah, yeah, drop off mm -hmm. this one two two, two. two. Yeah. okay uh, merci beaucoup <laughs> oh. uh, where are you from? Greater Chicago area. Ah, uh, Chicago. Yeah. Okay. It's cold. Yeah, very cold. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. Are you from Paris? Yeah. Nice. Uh, we'll come back at seven or eight or nine. Okay. 
Merci. Yeah, guys, so you saw we made a quick stop over here at the hotel and we were able to drop the bags off in and out real quick. They uh, get the bags with a uh, bag tag on there. Go explore the city, which we're going to do for the next however long. I guess you guys will see once you uh, keep watching this video and find out all the things we do. We'll go back here, pick up the uh, bags, head to the hotel. So quick and easy and welcome to Paris. Guys, we are uh, cruising down here. We're gonna stop and get ourselves a little something. Macaroons, yeah. Macaroons, yeah. It's gonna be Becky's first macaroon. Oui. <laughs> gonna get a couple, Becky? Oh, just one. Just one, yeah. Two cheesecakes and uh, one chocolate. S'il vous plaît. Oui. Typical American speaking, <laughs> trying to speak French. <laughs> oh, okay, so you know that. <laughs> yeah, yeah, exactly. Uh, yeah. <laughs> I'm, I'm more, you know, saying it, you know, Proud, you know, yeah. s'il vous plaît. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, merci beaucoup. Oh, this looks incredible. Thank you. We don't see too many of these in Minnesota. Cheers. Mm -hmm. Yeah, cheers. cheers. Oh, yeah. That's going to be delish. Let's see these reactions. I'm very curious how Becky likes it. That's good. <laughs> oh, yeah. This is nothing like it. Nothing like the one you had out of the freezer. Yeah. I get it now. <laughs> yeah, now you know the hype. Oh yeah, nothing like them. These are like chewy. Mm, they have yeah. a great soft. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Those are like hard. What do you think? Great. Mm -hmm. Fast. Oh yeah. yeah I, 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 no, I haven't eaten mine yet. <laughs> yeah, as Cody likes to say, good things don't last, so better go bite size. Mm -hmm. I do love my chocolate lava cakes, but that macaroon loaded with chocolate, delish. Or as Dad likes to say, G. Double O O D. <laughs> yeah, there we go. Honestly, there's probably no better way to start cruising around France than having a little sweet. So that macaroon got us all set. Now we're gonna cruise into the city. And let me tell you this: on a Saturday, it is crazy busy here. Clearly, the uh, pandemic slowing down all the travel here in Paris has totally ended. Some people still wearing masks, but you know the hustle and bustle in the city is popping. All right. We're gonna check out this place called the uh, I Love You Mural. I love you, bro. Oh, I love likewise. you, sis. <laughs> That's a popular spot here. Seems like everyone, their parents, friends, and family have made a visit. So is this like I love you in thousands of languages? Yeah. Wow. How many of them do you guys know? Uh, just 36 for me. 36, nice. That's pretty good. Yeah, it's a, it's a useful phrase. You know? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Je t'aime. That's here. Je t'aime, t'aime. Yeah. That's what I like. Uh, oh, I J'adore. like. J'adore. Oh, okay. In German, ich, ich liebe dich. In Spanish, te quiero. Te amo. No, it says right there, te quiero. Oh, really? oh. Yep. Te amo also, though. I think there's two ways to say it. Yeah. Guadalupe. Whoa, 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 Guadalupe oh just popped up. That's insane. Whoa, I'm literally filming you this whole time. How's it going? Hi, yeah. Guadalupe, nice to meet you. Yeah. Good, That's my sister, yeah. Nice to meet you, me too. Come here. Whoa, yeah, yeah. yeah well, well, I told you it would be my mock today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's lovely, though. Her flight was five hours delayed, so this is our no first stop. Way. Yeah. No. Uh, first, how do you feel? It's wonderful. Where, where was the first place you stopped, Becky? <laughs> where was the first place you oh, stopped? Oh, we got macaroons. No, 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 before that. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> that was of course. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yes, that's your newest customer. Oh. Yeah, yeah. So that was a uh, quick little glimpse of how to say I love you in many, many languages. I could only read probably three or four of them, but uh, we've picked up another person, and now we've got the four of us cruising on to the next place. Two stops in already, Becky. Right? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Are you already ready to interview? Yeah, yeah, exactly. Oh. Small world around here. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, so we're walking through some uh, picturesque streets here. Now we're gonna get a little bit of a workout going on. Got a few stories of stairs we're gonna be climbing here. That's the nice part about walking around Europe. You'll definitely put on quite a few kilometers. Or as uh, my us Americans say, uh, miles. <laughs> right, bro? That's right. <laughs> 20,000 steps is the goal for today. Let's see what we're at already. I'd say my guess is going to be 7,000 steps. Let's uh, check the good old handy dandy health app. 13,215 steps. So we're going to definitely surpass that goal. All right. We're getting into uh, the busyness of Paris now. Wow. We've got some... Uh, Drawn's here. You thinking about being drawn, Becky? Hello, <laughs> hello. Hello. Bonjour. Ça va? 
All right, quite a few paintings over here. Yeah. Lots and lots of types. Wow. Yeah, look at all these. Until the end of the world. Wow. Pari from the river. All right, looks like our next stop's gonna be the Sacre Coeur. <laughs> First time seeing the Sacre Coeur, bro? Uh, maybe. Nice. Either yes or yes in 10 years. Oh, sweet. Yes, yeah, yeah. a decade. Nice. That's what's good. Yeah. What do you think, Becky? Kind of what you imagined? Oh, I know what you imagined. Yeah. Very impressive. I feel like this is my first time ever seeing it. All right. We are about to see an amazing viewpoint of the city right here. <laughs> wow. There is a lot of people. Paris is back, that's for sure. Seems like the line's moving quite quickly here. There's a lot of people thinking about going in today. Let's see, it's 5.14. I bet we'll be in by 5.25. That's my guess. I guess 5.29. 5.29, all right. That's a good guess. <laughs> Bonjour. All right. Oh, so it's free to get in. Sweet! Free 99, bro. That's how we like it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, we miss you too. <laughs> yeah. Oh my god! <laughs> yeah, exactly. <laughs> Alright, we got the... Uh, oh, entrance here. Yeah, that looks like where everyone's going. I like that sign. No photos. <laughs> everyone's taking photos. Quite wild architecture here some of the craziest you've seen back here huh yeah <laughs> lots of stained glass up there like these domes the insides of them are just designed every square inch of them it's a live church though there's uh you know people coming here for service all right it makes sense when people are moving in and out real quick kind of just do a quick lap around the place and then you're done uh, you already know what time it is it is time to get some fresh crepes here it's not a trip to patty without getting some so we're gonna get some custom made right in front of us so once we're done in line mm, nutella bro mm, yeah so you're going right. for what's your what's your go-to crepe um i think that uh, cheese and ham cheese and ham mm -hmm. oh so it's like a little bocadilla crepe form <laughs> yeah, yeah that's the good stuff mm -hmm. gotta get inspired for the future trips bonjour Ça va. Uh, crepe de Nutella. Oh, crepe de Nutella. Yeah. Et aussi uh, crepe de jamon. Uh, one hot chocolate. And, and? one uh, cappuccino hot. No cappuccino. Uh, coffee. Mm -hmm. oh. Thank you saying wait for the crepes outside. Uh, outside. Uh, merci beaucoup. Come on, stay here. Do you mind? Oh, oh. chow's ready. Oh, there we go. We're picking them up. Oh wow, we got one down ready to go. You go for it. Oh, so here we go. We've already got one. number two in process. Yes. Oh, that looks delicious. Oh, what's your name? My name is Salisu. Salis? Salisu. Salisu. Nice to meet you. This looks delicious. Thank you. You're from uh, Paris? Yes, I'm from Paris. Yes. Uh, very nice. And you, where are you from? Uh, from the Chicago area. From? Chicago area, US. Chicago? Oh, yeah. okay. Yeah. Oh, this thing looks amazing. So you basically toss it up on there, and in about three minutes, that thing cooks up. You put a little Nutella on there. Oh, yeah. That is looking G triple O D. Good. You think so too? <laughs> yeah. First thoughts on that, bro. You look like you're digging it. Oh, oh, yeah. To be quite honest with you guys, this is the number one thing that I was most excited for outside of seeing my brother and sister in Guadalupe <laughs> is having a Nutella crepe. Oh, oh, oh. My friends, we are not in India anymore. I couldn't find these in India. This is a French native cuisine. So without any further ado, let's just chow on this thing. Mmm. How is that? Mmm. Let me tell you, that is incredible. It's a little chilly out here. We're talking probably zero Celsius, maybe two Celsius, 45, 46 degrees outside. It's warming up my hands while it's sitting here, and then it is warming up my stomach. That Nutella, almost like chocolatey flavor with the pancake-like bread. Mmm. 
That is so delicious. This really like <laughs> how you sell the crepe, huh? Mm -hmm. You're like, oh, this is really delicious. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Sweet. Becky! Oh, there she is. And how's that first crepe ever, Becky? Our first French crepe, official French crepe. I'm very curious how long it takes to make one of those. Oh, a lot of people around here. One of these days I'll come back to Paris and I'll get myself a sketch. But the, probably without the beard. That's what I'm thinking. The day wasn't any more picturesque. We've got the sun shining through the buildings. We've got the bells going off here. This is Europe. This is what you imagine, right? This is what happens in Spain too. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. You can almost dance to them. You see those dance moves? Whoa, holy moly, what is this thing? We got a lowered buggy right there. You ever see one of those back in driving through Paris? Yeah, exactly. <laughs> Just as you thought, it couldn't get any more picturesque. We've got Ve Paris right here with. Oh, almost fell up the, up the curb right there. You see that? <laughs> We've got a very beautiful restaurant right here. Wow. I don't know if those are real or fake flowers, but regardless, they did a nice job designing that, that's for sure. You know, they say if the uh, parking spot's too small, just get a smaller car. That's what this guy did. Smart move. Mm, little Moulin Rouge. Yeah. There it is, the Moulin Rouge. You know what it's about, bro? Uh, no, I don't. Oh, nice. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Oh, <laughs> yeah, that's good. Yeah. I didn't know that one. Nice to meet you. Nice to see you. Hasta luego. Hasta luego. Always. Bye. 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 See you. Yeah, this is the uh, California way to cross. You just start walking. Yeah. Yep. <laughs> All right. Yep. We'll try it out then. Here we go. All right. Back to the old hotel to pick up the bags, bro. We're gonna get, we're getting these things bounced back to us. <laughs> we'll have to grab a uh, Uber or a taxi. Sweet. To the hotel to drop the stuff. Uh, we could go to the hotel, or we could go to a place nearby, the Eiffel Tower. Should we stop by the hotel? I might as well. Okay. Yeah, yeah. So yeah, it's like a 15 minute drive from the Eiffel Tower. Yeah. So, do that. Cool. Yeah, drop the stuff and then, yeah, sweet. This is just too cool. Free the bags, we got our bounces. Whoa, hello. Yeah. <laughs> All right, now we're gonna go drop this stuff off at the hotel and uh, take you with us throughout some other areas into the yeah. evening here in Paris. Oh, Becky, you get the window seat. Or oh. oh, you might not be able to fit in there. Are your, are your legs too long? Would you like us? <laughs> There's the Eiffel Tower to the right, Becky. Oh, there it is. First views of the Eiffel Tower, Becky. Yeah, you're welcome. Yeah, it's official. Yeah, yeah. yeah it's official. Yeah. Once you see the Eiffel Tower, then it's then it's officially official. Oh, wow. You gotta go for a bike ride on that. The Chillax Mobile, bro. Oh, yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's a cool ride. Yeah, very cool ride. We have arrived. As we say, chale chalo, bro. Mm -hmm. There we go. Mm. Oh, allow me to get that for you, Becky. Oh, thank you. Oh. There we go. Yeah, merci beaucoup. Merci. Au revoir. Au revoir. Right, here we go. And we're back to the Ibis, where the siblings are staying. Welcome home, Becky. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Bonsoir à tous. Hello. Hey. hey. All right, you ready for this, Becky? Oh, yeah. Massive place. You ready? I'm ready. <laughs> Perfect. <laughs> Three beds, yep. <laughs> Two beds, yeah. <laughs> yep. Oh, I didn't even notice the photo up there. <laughs> <laughs> All right, we're back at it, bro. You ready for this? Yeah. Round two? Yep. Sending it back in the city here. <laughs> See you. Bye. Oh, cool. yeah, you got something back here? Yeah. Ooh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm. So glue. Bonjour. Bonsoir. Oh, yeah, right there. So glue. 
We found him. We located Sokolu. In the bends. <laughs> oh, it's okay. Go, you can go with the older bro. Uh, hello, Sokolu. Bonsoir. Ça va? Yeah. Oh. All right, we have arrived. Ah. Merci beaucoup. Bonsoir. All right. Hi ho, hi ho, off to the Eiffel Tower we go. Just up here and to the left will be the park that leads up to the Eiffel Tower. Sweet. Big moment for Becky. <gasps> mm hmm. Bienvenue à uh, Eiffel Tower. <laughs> Mm -hmm. Welcome to Eiffel Tower, bro. You know that one? See, yeah. Mm -hmm. That's a good one. Had to give you a special welcoming. Yeah, we got the lights up there. Oh, yeah. The bat signals. <laughs> there it is. Yeah, the Batmobile's up there. It's definitely better. Better in person than it is in photos. Right? You just can't capture it. We got some nature right there. We got the uh, rat running there. <laughs> yeah, there's ratatouille right there. He's looking for some cheese. Mm, come back. He's gone. <laughs> Mm -hmm. I hope so. <laughs> wow, the Eiffel Tower. There it is. So this thing's been looking like this thing for all, over a hundred years. What's the best fact you know about it, Becky? That was it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that it's 1,200 years old. <laughs> 120. <laughs> yeah. yeah. It seems like three platforms, right? Yeah. The main one down there, second one, and then one way up there. I think you want to go up there, Becky. You looking at it? Oh my gosh. <laughs> I'd probably have a heart attack. Probably at night it's, it's less scary because yeah, you can only see the night sky. I'll do it. Yeah. But it's like when the plane drops, you know, like you're Yeah, yeah, you're like, whoa. Yeah. <laughs> and you look down and get a little vertigo. Exactly. Mm -hmm. Wow. When you are standing next to the Eiffel Tower, it feels much larger than what you see in photos. That's for sure. Whew. How many stories is that? Probably uh, half the height of the Burj Khalifa, bro? Uh, no, probably not that tall, but it's pretty yeah. tall. Yeah, probably a one-tenth, I would say, of the Burj Khalifa. We got our electric biker out here playing the tunes, picking some people up, and some salesmen over here with some light-up Eiffel Towers. Hello. Bonsoir. Bonsoir. All right. Look at that with views of the Eiffel Tower. It doesn't get any better than that, my friends. Not at all. Les amis. My friend, do you know that one, bro? Les amis. What's that again? It means my friends. Ah, yeah. Bonsoir, les amis. That's pretty good French. Bonsoir, les amis. Yeah. <laughs> Not sure if that's working out. Got a nice little light up one, though. Yeah, I haven't got any euros since I've been here either. Merci beaucoup. Wow. Sorry. How much did they charge you? That was a little more expensive. It wasn't the one euro ones you heard? No. <laughs> that was the seven euro? Yeah. Nice. Uh, you just have six. to walk away, then they'll be like, what price you want? Mm -hmm. <laughs> so yeah. bad. Yeah, yeah. Becky's like, alright, six or alright, that's a deal. <laughs> I know. <laughs> yeah, bro. That's, that's a pretty good pick right there. We got the Eiffel Tower there, and we'll literally be able to see the Eiffel Tower from frame. I think the, uh, the diagonal angle is going to allow us to see it. Yeah, hopefully they have availability on no reservation. Seems like they've got tables. Look at that. The door takes itself. Wow. Bonsoir. <laughs> tell me you're a tourist without telling me you're a tourist. Huh? Is it tell me you're a tourist without actually telling me you're a tourist? Bonsoir, ça va? Très bien. <laughs> the French people here and they're like, geez, I hate Americans. <laughs> Bonsoir, très bien. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah, yeah, you were like, whoa, that's a pretty bad uh, accent there. Yeah. yeah. Yeah, it's a very special trip today actually because it's it's her first time ever coming to Europe. Merci beaucoup. All right, well this worked out pretty well. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Well, if you ask me, I'd say we got pretty lucky tonight. Oh yeah. Oh, so we've got the uh, menu here selling everything you could ever imagine: cocktails, alcohols. We got wines. Oh, red wines over here. Val de Lori. Oh okay, yeah, whatever you guys are getting as far as wine goes. Bourgogne. Beaujolais. Oh, Beaujolais. That's a song, right? I'm recognizing a couple of those names. Oh yeah, we got the fresh wine right there. Ooh, and that bad water. And by bad, it means good. <laughs> yeah. Is it pronounced bad? Mauvais. Beauvais. Oh. Mauvais. Mauvais. 
Oh. Oh, I thought I saw B A D on it. Oh. You say, oh, you see bad. Uh. Ah, because it's badois. Uh, no. Badois, yeah, yeah. Okay, no. there we go. I, because I, I was gonna say, I was gonna say, I swear I saw bad on there. You know. <laughs> yeah, it's badois. Yeah. Mm. The and brand of uh, yeah. the water. And what what our dad would say is, and that's bad. And by bad, I mean good. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Some slang right there. <laughs> Mm. Oh, perfect. Mm. Becky, for sure. Oh, yeah, please. Madame. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh. Yeah, she's going to slam it? <laughs> All right, she's giving me thumbs of approval. The other one is great, too. Both are good. Oh, that's a nice glass right there. Let's drink wine, yes. Mm, yeah. Merci beaucoup. Cheers. Mm, pretty good, huh? Je t'aime wine. <laughs> Does that make sense? <laughs> Je t'aime ben. Je t'aime ben. Mm. Ooh, we got the hamon in the soup. What type of soup is that? It's a chestnut soup. Chestnut. Oh, man, you know how to order the best stuff, bro. Yeah. I must say, that looks delish. Mm. Well, you deserve a good chestnut soup, man. Mm, that's true, that's true. Well, should we try out that hamon, Becky? Yeah. Here, let me give you this crust. Mm, mm, mm. You like the crust, right? Oh, gracias. All right, let's try this thing out. Mm. Mm. That's some jabon. Some yeah. tray bien trabon, if you ask me. Mm. Jabon. Mm -hmm. The good stuff, bro. We're going to be saying jamapel jambon by the end of this, bro. <laughs> All right, let's try out this chestnut. Delish chow. How is it, bro? Really good. Hitting the spot? All right, yeah. let's see. Next strip, I'm going for it. Wow, All right, there you go. Outstanding. Oh, thank you, bro. Let's try this one. Mmm. Oh, yeah. It's got a sweet, sweet flavor to it. Creamy, nice. Mm. A lot of different flavors built into there. Why don't you try another bite? Another spoonful. Mmm. I might have to. Don't yeah. mind if I do. Look at this. The bro is hooking it up. He's putting the plate under while it goes over this way. I got the napkin on the lap just in case. And <laughs> that is what we call G double O D, Becky. Would you say so? Absolutely. Mm -hmm. It's very complex. Yeah. All right. So what do we got going on over here, bro? We got the veal and the chicken. This one's the veal? Yep. Oh, man. That's a slab. And we got the chicken over there. For all three of us to share, that's probably a smart move because that veal literally could probably feed all three of us. Mm. Nice, dig in. Well, we're gonna give this chicken a shot here. Let's try it out. Mmm. Mm -hmm. Oh, that's nice. It's got a re really good uh, creamy sauce to it. And that chicken, good tender amount. You take a bite and that thing, it pretty much melts in your mouth. It's just here with a bro. Oh, yeah. That looks pretty delish, bro. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Some of the best chicken you've had in France? I'd have to say so. Nice, nice. And how about that veal? It's good. Which do you prefer, the chicken or the veal? The chicken. Nice, yeah, me too. Yeah, the veal's kind of got like a, uh, a fried layer on it. Let's chop that thing up right there. As you can see, it's almost like a sandwiched piece of veal right in there, cooked with a crisp on the outside. Mm. Very good flavor to it. I will say, probably tossing some of this uh, this sauce on there is something that'll do the trick. And we've got maybe, is that a pasta with it? Yeah, I think that might be a mini like side pasta to mix in there, so pretty dealish stuff. But I, I definitely agree after having another bite, analyzing the flavors, thinking about the chicken. The chicken is definitely my preference. Becky, how'd you like the food? Super! Uh, très bien then, yeah? <laughs> yeah, I think so. <laughs> mm -hmm, <that> nice. <laughs> yeah, nice. So the real question is, do you like the chicken or the veal better? I'm going to go with the veal. Wow. I enjoyed the red sauce. Ah, okay. Cody and I both chose the chicken. Oh, really? Mm-hmm. It was very close to all. Yeah, it was delish too, both of them. Mm -hmm. Oh wow. All right. Well, we got the uh, the Eiffel Tower. It's lit right now. Big call. After oh, you. Oh, see, I can take the middle. After you, bro. Yeah, I'll take the middle. Hello, Hello Fake call. 